this is an image of a chromosome made up of two sister chromatids during mitosis. And specifically, this is how you would see these sister chromatids in prometaphase and metaphase. So these sister chromatids or this chromosome is connected to these microtubules, as you can see on both sides, represented in green. Um, they have kinetochore uh, proteins associated with the center of the primitid, as you can see in red here, and that is at the centromere re region. And then the other thing that we see here are these green half circles. And these green half circles are also proteins called cohesins. These cohesins are very important because they make sure that the sister chromatids stay together and they don't separate before anaphase. Again, the, the cohesins are kind of like handcuffs, handcuffing the two sister chromatids together so that they don't separate until anaphase. Now, what allows them to separate at that point Let's look at the next slide here. And this is due to a series of proteins that interact with one another. Now we have this protein called securin and this protein called separase. Separase is an enzyme, which means it catalyzes chemical reactions. Securin is not an enzyme, it just binds to separase and it actually stops separates from working. So we call it an inhibitory protein. Again, it inhibits the action of separase. Now separase, you could tell kind of what it does from its name. When it's active, sorry, when it's active, the separase is actually going to separate the chromatids by actually getting rid of those cohesin rings. So the image that we saw before, these green guys, we see they're degraded here. This is due to the action of separase. So separase is gonna break down these cohesin rings. They're going to um, be torn apart essentially, and then you're going to be able to separate the sister chromatids. How do we go from having separase being inhibited by securin to it acting on the cohesin rings? Well, that's due to the action of this protein called APC. And this stands for anaphase promoting complex. So again, this protein called anaphase promoting complex is going to interact with these two proteins and it actually degrades securin. So the protein that was inhibiting, keeping the separase back, holding it back from being active, that gets degraded. And you can see that it's degraded here. And then the separase can become active and it is going to break down these cohesin rings. In this image, they're pink instead of green, but you get the idea. This separase is active and it's going to break those down so that the entire time the um, microtubules were pulling these sister chromatids to opposite poles of the cell. They're, they're pulling at them, but the sister chromatids were not able to be pulled apart because, the, again, they're handcuffed together, essentially, and these are really strong handcuffs. But once those get degraded by separase, the microtubules kind of get their way and they pull apart the sister chromatids and that's when we go into anaphase.